All right, uh, shifting focus to another big story that we are tracking on Mirror now. It's non-stop rains have battered southern parts of Tamil Nadu, wreaking havoc in multiple districts. Houses, streets, hospitals and railway tracks were seen waterlogged and people were seen wading through the rainwater. Thottuduri, Madurai, Nagapattinam, Thirunelvel and low-lying areas of Chennai. So waterlogging following overnight rains. A red alert has been sounded and worst hit Thutukuri district. In fact, a heavy rainfall warning has been sounded in 10 districts. Meanwhile, authorities have predicted heavy rainfall in Chennai for the next 48 hours. In view of the rain, schools and colleges are shut in 27 Tamil Nadu districts. This is the third time in a month that northeast monsoon has brought more rains in the state. Amid water logging in Chennai, the civic body is taking measures to dewater the flooded areas. Uh, my colleague Mugilan sent us this report. Heavy rains have picked up in Chennai once again. Following yesterday's evening rain, we have seen several areas were inundated, at least 59 locations were identified as waterlogged areas. And we have seen the Chennai Corporation have already deployed pumps at several locations and the works to pump out water from the waterlogged areas and uh, the water stagnant areas have already uh, begun and what we are hearing from the Chennai Corporation officials is that they have deployed 840 pumps in the areas where water logging was identified during last rain and uh, this time even before the rains have picked up they have already had placed those pumps in those areas to pump out water is what we are hearing from the Chennai Corporation officials and uh, uh, as now rain have picked up once again we are seeing the G GN Chetty Road in Tinagar is getting inundated and we can see uh, the men and missionary has been already uh, pushed into action uh, now the corporation workers here in GN Chetty Road trying to uh, pump out water from the clogged drains here in Chennai and the IMD also have predicted that the city will be uh, receiving rainfall, heavy rainfall for next 48 hours and Chennai Corporation says that they are adequately prepared. All their men and missionary already in place and the motors have already been placed in strategical locations to pump out water if water stagnation is once again identified after the heavy rain today and tomorrow. With video journalist Vijay Mugilan for Miranao. Now, week after week, it's the same story. KK Nagar, a residential neighborhood in Chennai, was waterlogged once again after a fresh spell of rain last night. Even several other parts are also waterlogged. Water pumps have been deployed to dewater these areas. Mugilan has sent us this report from Chennai. Starting yesterday evening, Chennai has received more than 6 cm of rainfall and several areas in Chennai have come underwater. Chennai Corporation have identified 59 streets with water inundation in more than 20 streets and the works are underway in all these waterlogged areas is what we are hearing from the Chennai Corporation and as of now, 3 streets have been uh, cleared with water and remain in the works in the remaining 56 streets are underway is what we are hearing from the uh, Chennai Corporation officials and we are in Rajamana street in KK Nagar and you can see that entire stretch have completely come under water so now the Chennai Corporation and uh, have deployed more than nine pumps to pump out water from these areas and Chennai Corporation say that they have uh, more than 840 e pumps placed at several uh, important locations where water logging was identified the last time and it will be put to use uh, if heavy rain is recorded in Chennai uh, from tomorrow as predicted by the IMD and the IMD has also uh, predicted that there will be heavy to uh, very heavy rainfall in Thiruvannamalai, Vilupuram, Chengalpet, Namakkal, Karur, Kanyakumari and Thiruvallur uh, districts today and the IMD has also predicted that there will be heavy to very heavy rainfall in the southern coastal districts tomorrow and in Chennai.